Babe. Yeah. How far now? Let's get some orange juice now. It's been a while though. Oh yeah, sure. All right? Yeah. Bye. Thank you. Hello. Yeah. Give me one thousand naira orange. Okay, sir. One thousand, right? Yes, sir. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. You know what? Let me just support your business. Huh? Yeah. See. Hello. Support your business. Yeah. Huh? Thank you, sir. Thank you very Thank much, you, sir. sir. Yeah. All right. Take care. Bye, bye, sir. Sure. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Babe. Hey, you. Babe, give me it? back that money. Give me back that money, what's going on? This one? Why are you giving them extra money? No? I give, what did they do? I am just trying to support their business. How? As what? As what, Kamsi? Stop this rubbish. I don't like this Look, nonsense. Don't create a scene. Please yet. do not repeat this rubbish again because I will not take it lightly with you. I said. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye bye, sir. What's the meaning of that? Eh? Why are you embarrassing me? Don't try this rubbish again, no. So, for crying out loud, don't you know we have a date? I, I almost forgot. Look, I went to the orphanage to make the donation. You know, I make the donations every month. I'm sorry. Wait, wait, and that is more important than a date with your fiancé? Babe. I said I'm sorry. I apologize to Betty. Yeah? See, you kept me waiting for a date we are supposed to have together. Now, yeah, you are standing trying to make me feel insensitive. See, can see. It's high time you stop being good in this wicked world. It doesn't pay. Now nah, I see someone's trying to look out for me, yeah? Babe, chill. Look, I am sorry, okay? Whatever. Can we now go for our date? Sure, sure. Let me just go freshen up so I'll look handsome for you, huh? You look good, though. So let just... me see the Bugatti now. You look torn now, let me see. Babe, please, just hurry up a bit. Let's go Calm first. down. I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. Chill. I'm coming, baby. Love is so fortunate. Love opens up for more. With just a little bit of time. Just a little bit of time. What's the problem? That looks like an accident. So? Babe, I have to help them. Babe, no, not again. No, I need to help them. No, I have you to can't help be them. doing this. What's going on there, sir? Now, one driver and I just jammed one there, and the girl down there. Oh, Jesus. What's happening, eh? Yes, help me, help me, help me. Please. Please. Carry her. Please. Please help me. Carry her, carry her from there. Help. Careful. Please. Come, come, bring her, bring her, bring her. Babe, we need to help this. What are you doing? Babe? We need to. What are you trying to Just do? relax. Come. Help 
Oh yeah. Move up. Thank you. Help me. Move up, move up, move up. died and to be left alone in this wicked world that claimed our parents mm. and made us orphans. No, 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 don't, don't talk like that. Nothing's gonna happen to you and your sister, right? <laughs> don't worry. Just be positive, okay? I guess. Wait a minute. So you also share your body the same way you share your money? I am so disappointed in you. Anita, what are you talking about? You know I'm not an infidel. Ma, I'm sorry. Oh, oh well, no. shut up your mouth, you destitute. Do you know what? You are as cheap as chips. Anita, you don't have to be so insensitive. Oh, don't you dare call me that. If anyone here is insensitive, then it's you. Nonsense. I'm so sorry, sir. I, I didn't mean for any of that to happen. There's nothing to be sorry about. You didn't do anything wrong, okay? God. Doctor, how is my sister? She needs an urgent blood transfusion. Uh, okay then, I will donate. I'm, I'm all positive. But still, we need to run some necessary tests to be sure that your blood is a match. Um, doctor, don't you guys have blood in your blood bank? Of course we do. Do I get it from there? I'll take care of the experts. Okay, that's alright. So, you hurry down to the bus three, make the necessary payments and I'll take it off from you, okay? Uh, excuse me, can I? Okay, thank you. Why did you do that, sir? It should have allowed me to donate my blood. At least it will reduce cost. No, no, you're not in the right state to do that. But, sir, I... I insist, okay? I got this. Don't worry. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. <sighs> So famished. He's just trying to prepare something for us. Okay, I don't mind helping in the kitchen. Babe, okay. kill you dead. Who is your babe? Oh, you now remember I exist, Abby? Why don't you go back to those people you helped so they can get you something to eat? Or don't they know one good turn deserves another? Come on, babe. Would you just would you just let those people be? If you have a problem with me, talk to me about it. We'll trash it out. And if I need to apologize, I'll apologize. And how long will you keep apologizing? You practically Chose those strangers over our relationship, Kamsi. My God. Babe, I practically chose to save a life. I practically chose to save a life because we can go on a date some other time. And to hell with your excuse. 
Look at my makeup. Do you know how much it costs? Eh? Jeez. You just succeeded in ruining my entire efforts. Anita, when did you become this cruel? We're talking about a human life. You're telling me about makeup. And you really? can go ahead and think whatever you like. I do not care. People die every day. So what's new with that? Thank you for ruining my day. Keep your stupid greetings to yourselves. Aren't you both ashamed of yourselves? Two grown adults like you can't even solve your problems. Rather, you prefer to be a burden to others. With all due respect, Ma, my, my sister and I are not burden to anyone. If anything, we know how to solve our problems without stressing anybody. Oh, shut up your mouth, you church rat! I can see that in addition to your poverty, you lack manners. Of course, just, just do No, I will not. If she has any problems, she should go and solve it with her man instead of coming here and talking down on us. Oh, shut, shut up your mouth! What do you want to do? Do you want to fight me? Oh, bring it on! Rat! Poor rat. Now listen. Do not ever talk back at me in your life. Rubbish. Come in. Good evening, sir. How are you? How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Good evening, sir. I'm getting better. I feel better. Please have a seat, sir. Okay, thank you. Uh... Um, hey, baby. This is the man that saved your life. Thank you so much, sir. I, I really, really appreciate it. I don't know what would have been my fate if you hadn't come to me on time. Oh, no, it's nothing, yeah? I'm glad you're doing good. I got this for you guys. Ah, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Don't mind, sir. Thank you, sir. The doctor says you're feeling great and you'll be discharged tomorrow in there. Um, I'm actually in much better now. Discharged tomorrow. But are you worried about the bills? Don't worry, I've cleared it. It's not a problem. What? Yeah. Yeah. Um, sir, we don't have any money to pay you back. Who said I'm asking for a refund? I'm not asking for a refund. All I need you guys to do is just to be good. Just take your drugs, rest properly, and be good. That's all. Hmm? Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Come on, Thank you, sir. What are you doing? No, 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 don't do that. No, come on, there's no need. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's fine. It's fine. I think I'll be on my way right now, but uh, we'll definitely keep in touch. I may not come see you guys before you leave, but I'll try and call or something. Okay, yes. sir. Yes, exchange. Contacts. Okay. You know, just put your number here. Okay, so I'm done in it right now, yeah? Okay. Thank you so much, sir. What is it? Yes, sir. Good, good. All right. Sorry, yeah? Take care of yourself. Thank you, sir. Bye, guys. Thank you, sir. Bye. Hey! Oh my God! Who this? Hey! The people have just got sent. Huh. My sister, is it not Kamsi and his stupid charity work? Do you know this guy practically forgot our date? And when we were finally on our way to the date, he stopped by to pick up one stupid girl that had an accident. Over our date, oh, my sister. 
<laughs> That's awful. I mean, what kind of a man chooses to help a stranger over a date with his woman? My dear, tell me. See, I am fed up of this nonsense. You have a point too. You're right. Okay. I will. <sighs> Talk to you later. Bye. Hi. Come see. Chidi, Anita is very self-centered. So selfish. She doesn't like to help nobody. Okay, you don't help nobody. Just allow me to help people. It's my thing. Huh? Can you imagine? She was complaining that her makeup was ruined. Who talks about makeup when you're talking about human life? I don't understand. See, Anita does. I mean, you should know that she's materialistic, but I don't blame her completely, too. Because every reaction has an action. Okay? You promised that you would take her out on a date. And you left her all by herself. You have to make it up to her, my guy. Well, I I understand your point though. I just I just see what I can do, but and it's crazy. It's crazy. I'm so happy you're getting better. I was really worried when you were still critically ill. Oh, well, thanks to God, I'm I'm much better now. Please, I can join you to continue our orange business so that we can continue to put food on the table. No, you will not. Didn't you hear what the doctor said? You need to rest. Besides, I can't stand you hawking anymore. At least not now. I'm still traumatized by the accident. I'm much better now. And, and that's all thanks to Mr. Kamsi. That man is really God sent. Yes, he is. Imagine him stopping me from donating blood to you. He even went as far as saying that the doctor should take blood from the blood bank. I even paid for it. Wow. God will continue to bless him and his family. Amen. He's such a good man. Ah, ah. Except for that, he's abrasive and, and, and wicked girlfriend. Don't say that. We don't know her that much. I'm sure she's not as bad as she behaves. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just last okay. Let me prepare your bath. Okay. Hey. Babe, hey, how was your day? Don't tell me you're still angry with me. Baby. I said I'm sorry. And that's all I keep hearing. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, you know what? Guess what? Babe, just leave me alone. I don't have your time, please. Alright. Breaking news. I've decided to open a supermarket for you. Oh my God. And I'm going to be taking you shopping tomorrow. Seriously? Oh my God. Oh, Thank oh, you oh. very much, Jeffrey. I'm a darling now, right? Now you're talking. Well, baby, you know I told you I love you so much and I can literally do anything to make you happy. See, but next time, do not get me upset, okay? All right, auntie. So now, what would you like to eat? Whatever the love of my life wants to give me, baby. In that case, why don't you go upstairs, freshen up so I can make your favorite meal. Ooh. That sounds like a plan, baby. Make it fast. I will, darling. All right. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> but that's right. You actually cook better than them. You know? Thank you, darling. <laughs> that's why I like you. Very good in bed. <clears throat> Sorry. Very good in the kitchen. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> You're so naughty. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't say that. It just came out, you know? 
This is like your favorite food, right? I know. If it's you that cooks it, then it's my favorite. If there's any stranger, then it's not baby. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's my baby. Wow. Hope you're not planning to have I'm so another. happy, like him. Ah. Why are you happy? Because of my job. Like, I wasn't expecting that at all. I know, right? I have a way of putting smiles on people's faces, you know. I know. I'm the baddest guy in the world. <laughs> you are. <laughs> so, baby, where is this shop situated at? Top secret, baby. Top secret. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love you. Come here. Come here, baby. Um, eating sugar. You're giving me sugar. Stay quiet, too. Don't go and, give, don't go and cause diabetes. Mm. Just like the one from the place is sweeter. <laughs> no, for real, baby. Try, try. Okay, it's the one you give me. Try it again. Let's see. Gold! <laughs> this I'm normal. Hmm? You're not. At this point, you're not. What have you given to me? What have you done to me? Hmm? Baby girl, what did you do to me? Nothing. Suspecting you, Sean. Because this is not normal. Mm -hmm. Love is patient. Is Love opens up a door. Love opens up a door. Love is endearing. Love is so fortunate. Love opens up a door. With just a little bit of time, just a little bit of time, everything alive. Your dinner is ready. Do you prefer I serve it here? I, um, I think you should leave it there. When I'm done, I'll go get it. Okay, no problem then. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm working on a proposal for a client. Oh, I see. It's actually a new client. When this clicks, I'm going to make a ton of profit. Wow. More money loading, I guess. <laughs> Babe, see. If this pays off, you're going to give me money for my hair and wardrobe. Okay? In addition to that, I will also be going for my manicure and pedicure this week, Saturday. <laughs> really? I thought you were talking about a plot of land in Ikoi or something. Oh, that's cool. Come, come. On. One after the other. That's small now. I got you, baby. Come <laughs> here. Huh? Anything for you, my love. You know, but the way you're touching me now, I might just drop this proposal. Please do know this mm. is important, very important exactly, at this point. Exactly, that's that's my point, baby. <laughs> so just help your brother out. Do, do not. It's do okay, not bye. Go call the giants. <laughs> Where are you going, though? I'm coming. I want to go pick up something from the other room. All right. I'll be with you shortly. I'll be with you, like, very shortly. <clears throat> Hey! Good day. Good day. Can't all our oranges. <laughs> I wish everything would be like today. Mm. <laughs> How much is that? Hey! So I go to the back, straight, straight. Um, How much is there? Hold on. How is this back? But wait, Mr. Kamsi gave us um, some tea things now. Kwezoko, we're still hey. here, intact. Yes. <laughs> That's uh, true. Kosi, 
That reminds me. Don't you think Mr. Kamsi has forgotten about us? This one has not called us since I got discharged from the hospital. Maybe it's because of that his girlfriend. Mm. I, I don't think so. Mm. Mr. Kamsi is a very good man. He's a nice man. I believe he has a good reason for not contacting us yet. Huh. Are you sure? Yeah, me, I'm thinking he has forgotten about us. Too. Ah, even though. He has tried now, eh? What else do you want? He has tried to pay your hospital bill. Oh, please, you should call us now. Eh, hey, call her. Go and buy bread. Let's drink tea. Uh -uh. You want us to drink tea with bread today? Yeah. yeah. And butter. Butter. And butter. <laughs> See the way you call this like bread. these rich people say oh. and butter. butter. <laughs> money is good. Money will fit us. I say money will fit us. <laughs> Hurry up, Babe, come down. <laughs> Babe, come see. Chill. I don't like Babe. what you do. <laughs> oh, you're so What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Hello, sir. Good evening, sir. How, how are you? How's family? Yes, she's she's fine now. Thanks to you. Okay, she will hear. Thank you so much, sir. Hey, what's up? Hey, boo. How's it going? Fine. How'd you do? Mm, what's going down? How was your first day at the shop today? Oh, business was great. Hmm. As a matter of fact, I had a lot of customers. It didn't really feel like it was my first day. Wow, that's great news. I'm so happy for you, baby. Thanks, babe. By the way, you're looking so happy. What's yeah. the reason? Um, I just I just got off from the call with uh, the girls that I helped. I mean, she's been discharged. She's doing so good. She's literally going back to her normal life. So happy for her. Oh, she's been discharged. Yeah. Wait a minute. Who paid for the hospital bills? I did. And how much was it? Uh, well, it's roughly 200k or something. Okay. No problem. <sighs> yeah. My baby. What is it? What's going on? Why the sudden change of mood, huh? Babe, let's get it. Kamsi, please stop this nonsense. I'm not in the mood for this, okay? Did you realize you just hit me? What's going on now? Baby girl, let's get it. Let's get it. Mm -hmm. Kamsi, leave me alone. I want to sleep. What are you?
Oh, Priscilla. Hello, darling. This one you're calling by this time of the day. Hope all is well. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. That means I overslept and Kamsi couldn't even wake me up. God. See, so you know what? I'll call you back later, okay? I have to quickly go open my shop. Oh, I didn't tell you. Kamsi opened the shop for me recently. Thanks, babe. Of course we can. You know what, I'll quickly send you my shop address so we can meet there. Okay? Talk to you later, darling. Wow, for real? Bro, no jokes, man. Can you imagine? Because I told her I paid Kosi's hospital bills. No more intimacy. She's just been very repulsive. But see, you don't have to blame her, okay? She's a woman and she's expected to act like one. Probably she's just probably jealous and she feels threatened. Threatened? Why? I'm a man, I'm not going nowhere, so why is she threatened? You know how women can be, right? You know, right? So let's just give her some time, okay? I'm, I'm sure she's gonna loosen up after a while. Okay. You know what, bro? Just come in and get some drinks. Let's talk about men. Exactly. <laughs> then you, did, did you see that match? You must be played. I want you. <laughs> Guy, come on here. I'm tired of cooking, darling. I'm tired. When are we going to start eating daily pieces like every other person? It will be. We just have to be grateful for the little we have. Tomorrow will be better. What do you mean by grateful? Grateful for what? Am I supposed to be grateful for this? Eh? Okay, how about we start a bigger business? Something more profitable. So that at least we can start eating well. It will be. You and I know that we don't have the money to start a new business. The little profit we're making from our own selling business is not even enough to put good food on our table. Let alone start a new business, a bigger business. See, I'm also tired though. I'm tired. It's so as if I enjoy drinking this every day. But this is the best I can do. Eh? Please, don't pressure me. I'm tired. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for not being understanding. It's okay. It's okay. It's, just, it's okay. I'm sorry. Fine. Let, let's bring the guy like that. I'm not complaining again. You're very lucky. See, Kamsi really, really loves you. Because it takes a man that truly loves you to open a big and beautiful boutique like this for a woman. And he's not even married to you yet. I know, I know, I know. I know Kamsi is trying. But see, let me tell you, all that glitters is no good. Though, because he still has his flaws. Hey, hey, Omo, even if not gold yeah. spray, shh, I go manage him. That's why it takes care of me. I sort my bills. Babe, I'm good. Yeah, I know. I know Kamsa is trying. It's not like I do not value what he does. Though. But see, my problem with him is that he likes helping a lot. Doing Father Christmas year and day. Imagine the other day. He gave 200k to Kosi to sort her sister's hospital bill. Can you imagine the nonsense? Money would have given me to at least upgrade my wardrobe. Ha! Wait. Kosi, the orange girls you talked about. Of course! Oh. But, but Anita, he still gives you good money. He takes care of you now. What do you call the fine? I beg, see, go and bring good champagne. Let's pop this. This, this, this is our new, our new, this is a plaza. It's not a shop. Yeah, it's coming, a plaza. Yeah, let's coming, let's to give me stress. Hey! Babe! This little ah, shop I'm trying to manage. Eh? Ah. What? Wow, wow. Anita, you're lucky, my friend.
Darling, I'm sorry for the way I reacted. I should have been more understanding. <clears throat> it's alright. Apology accepted. Thank you. By the way, you have a nice meal here, you know. Very tasty as usual. Oh, thank you. Should I get more for you? Sure. I mean... What else am I here to do if not to eat your meal and your meal, like, sorry, eat your meal. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> I don't know what I was Let's thinking. see you. I'll be right back. <laughs> you know, these ones are 100 naira. Mm, then this size is, you can sell them three, 200. Don't sell 50 15 era. Hey. How are you guys? Good day, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Uh, we were not expecting you. I want some oranges. Okay. Okay, sir. Hey, sir, let me cut it for you. All right. Oh, hmm. Mm. So nice as usual. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I want more. Okay. Give me more, yeah? Okay, sir. That's good. Uh... Uh, no, sir. Oh, we, we can't accept this. You have been doing so much for us. Uh, just see this as a form of appreciation for all that you have done. Look, I appreciate what I insist. Go ahead. Thank you, sir. <laughs> sir, I'm accepting this because you insisted. It's all right. It's all right. Um, I have to leave now. I have an appointment very soon. All right, sir. Take care of yourself. Thank yeah? you, sir. Bye-bye, sir. All right, bye. Thank you, sir. <laughs> she just said no one in me. Bye-bye, sir. Bye, sir. Take care of yourself. You too, sir. You know this big girl. Hey, see plenty money. Hey. <clears throat> Come back out till you mm. finish it. I'm gonna sell it finish. I'll use the other knife. Okay.
Any other thing should I for you do this? I will shit. Shit, okay. Yeah. It is shit. Right? Yeah. How about this? Why are you looking at me like that? When are you coming to pay my bride price? Or you don't want us to get married? Babesy, we've been dating for over four months now. So what's the problem? Come on, babe. Of course, I really want to marry you. It's not like I don't want to marry you. It's just that marriage is expensive, so I have to save up. And you know it's not easy to marry from your side, too. Hmm? Anyway, that's your business. Yeah, you're talking about expensive. Meanwhile, you have money to throw on complete strangers. Eh? Better go and pack all those money and come and do the needful, please. I don't have this time. All right, auntie. I'll hasten up. Come here. You leave me, Joe. I don't want my friends to make fun of me. So just hasten up, like I said. And I said, all right, auntie. <laughs> <laughs> Please. <laughs> I just feel you know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing, baby. But do not try me. How? Because you know what I'm capable of doing. I don't know. I'm not aware. Try me then. How? How should I try you? <laughs> how do you want it? <laughs> hmm? Oh my god, baby, just ow! <sighs> Babe, are you not ready yet? It's past 9 a.m. We're late for church. Babe! I'm coming, honey! Oh my god, so sorry for keeping you waiting, darling. It's fine. Can we go now? First of all, how does my outfit look? Um, by the way, does this outfit look good on me? Why won't it look good since you spent all the time? Huh? Baby, is that supposed to be an insult or a compliment? Baby, you know you're very beautiful. Like, your charm is 100 over 100. You literally don't need anyone's validation. Huh? Thanks, baby. Come here. Mm. Wait, church keys. We are late for service. <laughs> I know, right? So this was awesome today. Hmm. This is what I'm talking about. Yes, this so, is how church services should be like. A lot of praises, dance, mm -hmm. good sermon. Did you see how I was dancing? Hmm. The praise and worship was something else. I love that session. <laughs> For me, I'm tired though. Mm -hmm. After all that dance. Uh -huh. Sleep. What did you say? I want to sleep now. Hey, see, those oranges will not wash themselves. So you better get up, get up, get up. Go and wash them. We need to leave early ah. tomorrow morning. Are we not even going to eat Sunday rice first? Did I say we will not eat Sunday rice? Eh? Well, we'll cook. I will cook. While I'm cooking, you'll be washing the oranges. Mm. Hey. We should dance now. Ah, foggy. Oh, yeah. Time to walk. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up.
So hungry, very hungry. Aren't we just coming back from church together? Ha! Hey, calm down, Joe. Anyway, I'll quickly go to the kitchen and prepare something. So, what would you like to eat? Anything, babes. Rice. Just prepare something, eh? Okay. In that case, go freshen up, okay? While I rush to the kitchen. Yeah. And I'll be in the kitchen. Please, babe, just help me drop my bag and my shoe in my room. Thank you. Ooh. Oh, God. Uh -uh. Babe, why did you pack the car? Has the fuel finished? Oh, no, babe. I just want us to get oranges from those girls. You remember those girls? Now? Babe, you have started again. What's the meaning of this rubbish? I am just coming back from work. We are just coming back from work. So we are, I, I need to rest. I am very tired. Come on, babe. Please, let's just get the oranges. Please, we need... It's not going to take anything. All right? Please. Hey guys. Welcome, sir. How's Welcome, business sir. today? Ah, sir. To be honest, market has been very, very dry today. We've not even sold a single orange. Oh. Don't worry, I'm here to change the narrative, okay? Okay, sir. Just put put some oranges for me, yeah? Okay. Hmm. How many oranges? Just, sir? just keep putting. Just keep putting, yeah? More, more. Okay, that, that's fine. That's, that's, that's fine. Yeah, sure. Okay, so, um, just, uh, I'm giving you this money because I know if I give it to your sister, she'll say no. So, have it. Sir, that's not necessary. Come on. This is too much. You've done more than enough. You Santa should have Don't worry. Okay, just use that and support your business, okay? Thank you, Thank you, sir. I got you. I got you. Sir, this means a lot to us. It's Thank fine. you. It's fine. Bye. Bye, sir. Bye. Bye. Eva, Eva. Hey! Go bless this man, though. Bye, go back. What was that for? What? Eh? Why did you give those girls 10,000 naira? Oranges you got should be less than two thousand naira. What exactly is the problem, huh? That I gave ten thousand naira to the girl, or that she's the same person I paid her hospital bills that you did not approve of? Come see. Is there something you are not telling me? What exactly is going on between you and that girl? Eh? That money you gave her should be enough to at least fix my nails or buy something reasonable. I should be asking you what is going on with you because you have never for once asked me for money for your upkeep and I said no. What's your problem? Can it be deal, eh? You know what? Since it's like that, I'm going to send money to your account tomorrow. Is that okay? And make sure you send it. Get out of my way, please. Babe, hold on. What's up? Babe, there is something I would like to discuss with you. Is everything all right? Oh, yes. So I was thinking about that cosy girl joining me in my shop. You know I need a helping hand. Cosy. Why cosy? The same cosy you don't like? The same cosy that you always antagonize me because I, I try to help her life? Well, let's just say I now understand the importance of being good. Let her resume work first thing tomorrow morning. And please tell her I do not condone lateness. Babe, 
Well, that's that's good. I, I just hope she accepts your offer. Of course she will. At least it's a better offer than selling oranges on the street. Yeah. I know, right? Mm -hmm. uh, are you joining me? Of course. Please oh. wait for me. You have to pay. <laughs> Good day, sir. Good morning, Kosi. My girlfriend wants you to work in a shop. Do you accept the offer? See, I won't force you if you're not interested, so just tell me if you really want it, okay? I accept. Okay, then. You begin work tomorrow morning. I'll send the address to you. All right, thank you, sir. Hi, sister. Who was that on the phone? Mr. Kamsi. So what does he want? He said that his girlfriend wants me to come and work for her in her shop. Did you accept? Of course I did. I feel like it would be weird if I say no. After all, he has been helping us. If I say no, he will see us as ingrates. After all, I will be earning extra money. And in another way, that will be me repaying him for everything he has been doing for us. Are you sure about it? It's not a big deal. It's fine. Okay. So, what's the money with you? Yeah, hey, please just give me some little time and I'll join you shortly. Yeah, the stupid employee is not yet here. And it's supposed to be a first day at work. Please, I'll just join you in maybe like in 10 minutes time, please. How dare you? How are you coming by this time? Eh? Oh Did Thompson not tell you that I don't condone lateness? What's the meaning of this rubbish? Eh? See, don't, don't try this rubbish again. No. Oh, what you and that's your useless sister know how to do is how is to sit in your house and wait for, for strangers to dash you people money. <laughs> Lazy thing. I don't blame you. Your mother did not bring you up. Oh. Nonsense. I'm leaving. I'm going somewhere urgently. Make sure you take care of the whole shop. Okay? Attend to any customer that comes. Get out of my way. <laughs> Hey girl, how are you? Guess what? That Corsi girl now works for me. Oh yes, why not? See, I'm already making life a living hell for her. Today I gave her a hot, dirty slap for coming late. See, by the time I'm done with that thing, that little rat, she might not leave to tell the story. Trust me. Babe, please, I'll talk to you later, okay? I have things to attend to. All right, bye, darling. Bye. Nonsense. Love is patient. Love is caring. Love
Is everything okay? The matter now. Oh, what's this now? What's with all the jump questions? Eh? Can't I rest? Can't I rest? I just got back. I've not even sat down. You're already interrogating me. What is all this now? Eh? Can't, can't, can't I just rest? <sighs> Sorry, yo. I was only being concerned about you. Come back. Sorry, uh, I didn't mean to lash out on you. Just that, that lady is frustrating me. She's really driving me nuts. Could you believe that she slapped me today just because I was only a few minutes late? You know that I woke up early. Eh? I left this house by 6 a.m. If I could even explain myself, she had already given me a dirty slap. She slapped you. She didn't even end there. She just kept threatening and insulting me. Oh, God. Uh -huh. But I told you not to work for this woman. I told you. She doesn't like us. This thing she's doing, she's doing it to get back at us because of how much uh, Mr. Kamsi likes us. You know what, let's just forget about her. Hmm? <laughs> she just brings nothing but bad and negative vibes. Let's not think about her this night. How was business? Business is fine, but it would have been better with you there. Imagine you do even ask about you. Ah, Chai. You know what, one of these days I'll find time to come to the spot. At least so that our customers will know that I'm still very much around. Yeah. Okay. Is there food? Yes, there's food. Let me go and show them. Slap, slap, slapping me every time. Slap. Oh, oh guys. How's it going? Hey, sugar, what's up? How's it going? Fine. Ooh. Hey, voila, for we no get big. Imagine. How was that, baby? <laughs> But it was great. Hey, What's up now? How are you? I'm man, good. You're looking pretty, man. Oh, thank you. Ah, ah. <laughs> it's your business. You're as a <laughs> Coming from someone that has a wife and two kids. <laughs> what, what, where's your evidence? Like, uh, are you denying? Sure? <laughs> uh, you, get, you guys must be really hungry. So I should get you something to it. But you know what? I think I'm fine. Just give me water. You uh, sure? Yes. He needs to just water. Me, I'm very hungry. Just <laughs> help my ministry, please. I know. Guy. <laughs> Yeah. Mm. What's up? Oh, this your baby is very nice. She's I know, good. right? Yeah, she's good. She's good, actually. She says that she doesn't like it when I help people. That's the only challenge I have with her. Yeah. Nah. It's all good. My guy, we can freshen up, yeah? Okay, no problem. Should we get just... you your water now? Yeah, I think they're still playing this match, too. Which match? <laughs> After we don't win it now. <laughs> Oh dear, that was crazy. <laughs> Don't worry now. Okay. Enough with the stare already. Come on. I am just admiring God's beautiful creation. Huh? So when are you going to make this beautiful lady your wife? Ah. <sighs> I was actually going to ask you to tell your mom to help us collect marriage list. Oh my God! <laughs> Finally! Wait, wait, is this supposed to be some type of proposal or what? Yeah, it is. Oh my God, come here! Mm. I love you, darling. Thank you very much. I love you more, baby. Thank you. Wow! Finally! I knew you were going to be happy, yeah? Are you gonna be happy? Of course I am. So oh, how was business finally. today, my baby? Oh, business was good. Oh, that reminds me. Today was um Kosi's first day at work, Abi. Mm hmm So how was it? Hmm. Babe, do you know that girl literally came late to work? She's oh. very annoying. See, I'm just tolerating her because of you. Didn't you tell her that I don't condone lateness? Oh, I... I forgot. Look, I apologize on behalf of her, alright? Put the blame on me. Hmm? Maybe like I said, it's because of you I'm tolerating that girl. Because... Because what? Because... Because <laughs> what? 
<laughs> because what? <laughs> what will happen? Baby, enough of that girl and let's talk about us. Talk about what? Baby? Let's celebrate us. Mm. <laughs> you know, I can't wait to have your children. <laughs> I know, right? I can't wait to give you children. You're not even serious. What salary? When did I start work and I pay me salary? All you know how to do. That would be suffering. Eh? You better warm that soup. Oh. Eh? Hey! It has soured. We will eat it like that. Just put Maggi, buy onions, put pepper, so that it taste will come up small. <laughs> I'm in the shop, oh. They're expensive. At least it's better than selling orange under the hot sun. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> And what are you doing? Answering calls while you're on duty. Who taught you that one? Eh? Where did you learn that one from? You're such an unprofessional. Nonsense thing. Look at you. See me trying to help your life by bringing you out of, of poverty. So you cannot learn, learn the needful. Useless. And by the way, who are you talking to? I know it's one of all those your useless boyfriends in town. And of course, I have nothing to offer to you. Because oh, you're bigger. Your sister what? Liar. Good. Shut up your mouth. Sorry. Sister, so sorry for yourself. Are you not to get tired of saying sorry this girl? What's wrong with you? When will you learn how to take responsibilities for your action? And stop making silly mistakes? Rubbish. Now get busy at once. See, clean up the shoes fast. I've cleaned everywhere, ma. You've cleaned everywhere. Come, come look at that shoe. Clean it again. Clean everywhere again. I, I watch with your big head. Nonsense. And arrange those clothes properly. Hey, hey! See. You want to carry something that. You I want mean. to carry something that. Lazy thing. Unprofessional. Sense. Better be fast about that, too. Don't allow my customers to walk in and, and see you doing that. Uh, one hundred naira. Ah, no, that one, that time don't pass. Uh, give me 200 naira. 200 naira. Uh, I would say sweet. Uh, ah, okay. Sweet, wait, wait. Hey, hey Bube. Good afternoon, sir. How are you doing? I'm fine, sir. How is the family? I'm good. Everything is good. Well, I hope the fact that Kosi, your sister, is working for my girlfriend is not really affecting your orange business. So to be honest, it's it's really, really affecting because my customers keep asking after my sister. And and you know, this is my business. She's the only one that knows how to manage it properly. Hey, that's a good one. It's a good one. Yeah. At least with time, you're going to learn too, right? Yes, I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying. It's fine. So I, I want some oranges for myself and my girlfriend. Okay. How much on, sir? Uh, let's say 1,000 now. 1,000. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> These ones are so fresh. Sir, don't worry. I'll give you the fresh one. I trust you. Yes, sir. Let's go. Uh, this one is more than 1,000. Yes, sir. It's because it's you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if I, I... I don't think I have cash. Would you take transfer? Eh, uh, sir, just, just don't worry. Just forget about it. Really? Yes, sir. Just see it as a way of me thanking you for all you've been doing for my sister and I. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye, yeah. sir. Bye. Is everything good, though? S sir. What's that? I I actually want Ted to make a complaint. About what? Is everything all right? Never mind, sir. It's fine. But you said you, you wanted to make a complaint, now. Sir, don't worry. Just, it's fine. Are you sure? Yes, sir. All right. Take bye care bye, of yourself, man. Bye. Ooh. Just... <laughs> 
Mm. Babe, how was your day today? I was fine. <clears throat> Although I went a bit late because I had to do laundry. Oh. By the way, this oranges taste really nice. I know, right? Where did you get them from? From Ibube Kosi's sister. So the orange is always I very bear! nice. Oh my god! How dare you get me oranges from those girls? Babe, what's the meaning of this? I thought you said you don't have issues with them anymore. What's going on? Well, um, yeah. Um, it's just that, um... Just that what? Well, that reminds me. Did anything happen with Kosi? How? Why? Nothing, it's just that when I saw Ibu Bay, she was trying to tell me something. She was, she was like, she had a complaint. Then when I inquired more, she was like, there was nothing. Wait, so, wait, wait, wait. Are you insinuating that I am maltreating Kosi? Of course not. That's, that's not what I'm saying. Better. Well, are you maltreating her? You, you're not maltreating her, of course. Why would I? Yeah. Yeah. What's up? Take your orange now. Baby, it's okay. I've lost appetite already. Really? Come on. You I said I am fine. I'm oh. fine. Nothing serious. Oh, wait, wait. Does this have to do with the girls? It doesn't. Sure? Yeah. All right. Hmm. Always made in Puerto Rico. Cosi, Cosi, where's that girl? Come here, come here. How dare you? How dare you tell your sister that I am maltreating you? Eh? Didn't you tell her what you did wrong? Useless thing. Eh? What's the meaning of this nonsense? See, let me tell you. By the time I am done with you, you will regret ever knowing me in this your life. Henceforth, you have to work here till 11 p.m. for one month. Is that clear? Is that clear? Yes, ma'am. Rubbish. And make sure you resume before 6 a.m. Nonsense. Why is that your phone? Why is that your useless small phone? Get it fast. Fast. Nonsense, girl. Lazy thing. Big. Give me that phone. And see, if you think you can deceive me, I have CCTV all over the shop and I will be watching you from my laptop. So don't try rubbish with me. Get busy at once! I, I don't like when I'm talking and you're standing there looking at me. Oh. I don't like that, oh. Big. See the dress with me? Did you wash this dress before coming to this shop today? So why is the whole, the whole place smelling? Eh? You cannot wash your clothes with common detergent. How much is detergent? I don't know, eh? Shut eh? You see, can't see. Can't see just because of this, this whole rubbish, oh. <laughs> Hey, baby. Who's up? Um, fine. Um, can I make use of your phone? My phone? I'm using my phone now. I want to use for something, please. Come on, babe. I'm using my phone. Oh, is this something you're hiding from me? I don't understand. What do you mean? Don't you trust me? Then let me make use of your phone. Babe, I'm using my phone. I'm doing something. Baby, I'm going to be fast about it, please. Wait, 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 you, wait. Give me your phone. Like right now? Yes, I need to make use of it quickly. Don't worry, I'll be right back. I'm coming, baby. Some 
Если бы один бы сошел. Hey, what happened now? You happened. How dare you? I don't understand. What are you talking about? What I'm talking about? Why did you go to confront my madam? Hmm? I didn't want to even tell you everything that was going on in that shop. But you, you insisted I tell you. I, I thought I was confiding in my sister. Not knowing that I was telling a parrot, a radio with her battery. What are you talking about? I didn't tell her anything. You didn't? No. So how did she know what we talked about? I don't know. Okay, fine. I, I, I remember telling Oga Kamsi that I wanted to confide in him about something. But then I, I told him not to bother that I'll handle it. That was the only thing I said. Mm. Oh, I get it now. I, I guess he told Madame Anita that you wanted to tell him something and change your mind. And you know how fast and smart that wicked witch is. She probably just put one or two together and figured out that you probably wanted to tell him everything that is going on, how she's maltreating me. I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to accuse you. It's fine. So is that why she kept you dead till this time? Yes, she even seized my now. phone and slapped me. She, has, <laughs> she slapped you. Because we are poor. <laughs> no problem. No problem. <laughs> it's okay, I'm, I'm fine. At least I'm home now. I'm sorry for accusing you, okay? I, I thought you were comforted. And you know you, your mouth was going to stay up. It's, it's fine. It's fine. I was, I was just here worried about you. And, and, and you were busy accusing me. It's okay, okay now. Are we going to want to slap me like we get at the end? <laughs> I'm so tired. She didn't start. No lunch. No thing. It's fine. Just sit down. Let me go and pay water for you to eat. And I hope you've not finished that. I've not finished it. I kept it for you. Just eat your big head. <laughs> You still here? Yes, darling. I'm still trying to round up on my makeup. I gotta go now. Alright. I love you. Have a great day at work, okay? And make sure you come back on time, please. I'll try. Love you. Love you too. So how is work, baby? Okay. No problem. And that reminds me. I'm going to keep your food on the dining table so you can microwave it when you come back. In case I'm asleep. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. Business is fine. That lazy girl, very useless thing. Please, please just forget about Kosu. Just forget about Kosu. It's because of you I'm tolerating that girl, and you know it. Okay. Talk to you later then. Bye. Kosu. 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 What's wrong with you? Eh? Didn't you hear when I was calling you? I was actually... Don't, don't, don't stop me from answering me! Hey! What? 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 what, what liability like you and your sister? I saw my boyfriend has done for you! I, 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 what's, I, I, going I, I, what's going on here? What's your problem? Babe, I, I, I thought you said you'd be coming back home late. So that was an opportunity for you to maltreat her and beat her? No, I was only trying to correct her. Correct her? Or you're going to carry knife and correct her? <laughs> Kosi, pick your bags and leave at once. You are done working here. 
Just leave the rest for me, okay? I promise you. I promise you that I got this. And I will compensate you for every bit of this BS. that how dare you insult me in front of my employee shut up your mouth your former employee look you have just done a very shameful thing and i'm very disappointed nonsense Can't do what? I can't continue to work for that wicked lady. I can't. So I resigned. She has practically turned me into a punching bag. Every time she hit me, she slapped me. For no reason. Could you believe she was at it again today? Uncle Kamsi walked in and witnessed everything. Oh my God. I guess I will just... I don't have any option. We'll just have to continue our own business. After all, we're okay when we're doing the wedding all done. My God, why are all these bad things happening at the same time? Why? What are you talking about? The new landlord of this house came here today and they told us that we should leave, that they are demolishing this house tomorrow morning. What? Yes. Now we are practically homeless. Baby. Baby. Baby, please, I would like to have a word with you. What is it, Anita? What is it? Babe, see, you can't just ruin our relationship because of a total stranger now. <sighs> wait, wait, wait. You think it's about Kosi, yeah? He has absolutely nothing to do with Kosi. It has everything to do with you. How, how can you, my supposed dear wife, to be lied to me? You literally deceived me that you have no bad intentions towards Kosi and her sister, only for you to be maltreating that girl, treating her like a prisoner at my back. Babe, see, at least you would have asked to know exactly what transpired before jumping into conclusion just like that. Really? That's what you want to start telling me, right? See, babe, I'm a very peaceful person. Of course, you know I'm not that kind of person, eh? Just leave that thing alone. Look, 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 I'm not here to argue with you. Just know that I'm disappointed. You are a very wicked person. I did nothing wrong. Anita, you're wicked. You're wicked. Me? Anita, you're wicked. You're talking to me like this because of a stranger. Oh, you want to nag, right? Enjoy. I am room. not. No, 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 no. no. I, I of course, you know I'm a very babe. peaceful person. No, babe. If this is what you want to do here, I can't. I, I need to sleep. I need to wear. Babe. I need to rest from all the, all, I can't even understand, you don't understand all the trauma you put me through. I need to... Are you walking out on me because of that girl? Babe, that bed is very enjoyable, enjoy it. Kamsi! I really don't know why Kamsi is so upset with me. Even if I beat Kosi, how does that make him angry to the point that he snubs me. And the annoying thing is that, despite all my apologies, he is still adamant. No, I can't bear this any longer.
Amsi, what's the meaning of this? What are they doing here? Everybody, Kosi, let's go up. Come see, I am talking to you. What's the meaning of this rubbish? Come see. Come. Hey, Bube. Sure. Are you okay? Yes. Have you had something to eat? No. Why? Um, you know what? Just go in there and dish food for yourselves. Alright? Okay, Don't dare! You know what, guys? Let's head out and buy food. Hmm? Let's go. Okay, sir. Hey, hey, wake up! So you guys think you're on vacation, right? Now listen to me. Kosi, you will sweep and mop the entire house. And as for you, Ibubi, you will wash the plates and do the laundry. Have I made myself clear? Yes, yes ma'am. Better hurry up. Nonsense. Oh. Because it's because of you. It's because of you that we are, that we are taking all this rubbish. Oh. Eh? What's all this now? Mitchell, forget it now. Don't you ever get tired of talking? Hmm? Was that the one that insisted to come here? Was it not Mr. Camps' idea? I was only trying to be him. See, I, I'm not in the mood for this, your, your up, up and down movement. See, just get up. Let's just do whatever this wicked auntie wants and have peace. That Kosi, what are you doing there? Why are you watching TV by this time? Are you done cleaning this place? Yes. How? With my house still looking like this? Will you stand up from there at once? Go get a mob and, and, and bucket first to clean this, this pile of... You're looking up... Stand up from there at once! Stupid thing. Watching TV. Like you watch TV in your house. Nonsense. Look at my palo. What's going on? Why are you why are you sitting on the floor? No thing, sir. Have you guys had something to eat? No, sir. You don't want to eat? By this time? I want to eat. Come with me. Come.
Ah, we'll see. You're still cleaning? Yes, sir. Have you had something to eat? No, sir. Anita, what's going on? Won't they eat? Anita, I'm talking to you. Are they not going to eat something? Um, Kosi and Edubo, you can go to your room and freshen up. While I quickly dish your meal. Kosia and Ebube, your food is ready. I want you girls to eat and enjoy yourselves, okay? You know what? I want you both to eat and enjoy yourselves. <laughs> what is it? It doesn't smell nice? No? Oh, you don't like the way it's looking? See, trust me. Just eat and, and you will enjoy, you will love the meal. So, why the sudden excitement? I don't understand. How? Do you so desperately want to get rid of us that you had to poison our food? How, how dare you accuse me of such? Eh? See, yeah, I despise you, but, but wanting to kill you guys is something I would never do. No! Uh, <laughs> you know what? I believe you. You're so innocent, right? <laughs> of course. Of course. Then you will not have any trouble tasting the meal. After all, you made it. I won't! Why would I? Eh? See, only a guilty person um, 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 proves their innocence. So I am not. I am not going to do that. Yes, you will. You will Why would food. I? You must taste this food. Taste the food. Taste this food. Taste now. what food? Are you okay? Are you mad? Taste the food. Taste this food. Guys, what imagine what is happening? Imagine these two sisters after dishing their food. Instead of them to thank me, they have the guts to accuse me of, of poisoning their meal. Why would I do such? Of course, you know I can do such. Ha! Why would I do such a thing now? Is that so? Sir, she's not being honest. Because my sister and I saw her putting a substance inside our food. Baby, see, do not believe them. They are liars. You're lying. You're not lying. Why would I do such a then thing? Of course, eh? mm. I know you can't do stuff like that. Then. Yes. So just go ahead and taste it to prove them wrong. Yeah, just wrong. taste it. Simple. Oh, seriously? Please. Even you? What do you, you know what I am? Fed up of this nonsense. Enough of this rubbish. Nonsense. I am leaving this house immediately. Right away. Nonsense. Stop her. I will take instructions. I will. I will. Look at this. You are not going anywhere. Are you mad? In my house. I will break your head.
My friend Priscilla, that's exactly what happened though. Those girls have succeeded in winning my relationship. Ah, God will judge them. I've always known they're up to something. Yeah. Poor stupid things. You can imagine the nonsense. I just had to leave you. Hmm. Ah. See me now, Priscilla. See me. See me. A relationship I took my time to build for months. Now those girls just came from nowhere to spoil it like that. Ah. Ah, yeah. I'm still in my shop. I'm just, I'm just trying to stay low key for now. Let me just see what will happen. I'm just here watching. Guy, what's up? Ah, you sounded urgent on the phone. What's up, my guy? Bro. Anita will not kill me, man. Can you imagine that Anita has been maltreating those girls, Abube and Kosi? I brought those girls to stay with us in the meantime, before I can get somewhere cool for them to stay. But Anita has been, Anita has been making life miserable for them. This morning, she just walked out of the house angrily because they accused her of poisoning their meal. Okay, Anita, I know you did not poison their meal. I know you very well. Prove them wrong. Just taste the meal. She got angry and walked out. Wow, that, that's actually very bad. But you see, you just have to calm down, okay? You just have to calm down. All over the world, just calm down. Sure, I'm yeah. down. But, but what do I even believe right now? Because I don't... Do, does it really mean she poisoned the meal? Because, Anita, you did not poison the meal. Just, just taste it. She walked out angrily. Bro, I'm just confused. I'm stressed. I understand, okay? What I just feel is that you should... You need to just calm down, okay? She's going to be back. Just calm down. Okay? Guy, come on. It's not about her coming back. I just need to know what I'm doing. At this point, bro, I just... It's fine. It's all good. It's all good. Okay, let's just get out of here. Let's go have a conversation yeah. somewhere, okay? What's up with your wife and your kids now? Man, we thank God for life. Thank God. You just have to calm down, okay? Yeah. Uh, what's up? Sorry to disturb you, but can we have a word? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Um, we know it's none of our business, and we don't mean to interfere with your affairs, but we're wondering if you could bring back your fiancé, no matter what it is that she has done. I believe it's something that can be sorted out. Please find a way to make her come back to the house. Yes, uh, you know, it's, it's, it doesn't actually look good on my sister and I that just barely four days we've been here and, and, and your fiancé has already left the house. So, so my, my, my sister and I have, we have decided that we'll be leaving this evening. No, come on. Nobody's leaving. You guys will not leave until I find an apartment for you. That was the plan. Hmm? Don't worry, you're worrying too much. And as for Anita, I, I don't want to be in a hurry to make any decision about her, okay? Just know I got this. I'm working on it. Okay, sir. Yeah. You guys are good, right? Yes. Nothing else? No, sir. I need a gun. Now. I don't care. Get me the gun. I have to kill Kosi and that her devilish sister myself. Never bother. I know my way in. Hi. 
evening. Good evening. Uh, I guess you're Kosi and Ebube, right? I'm sorry, who are you? <laughs> My name is Priscilla. I'm Anita's friend. She has told me a lot about you too. Especially you, Kosi. Um, but what I'm seeing right now contradicts to all she said. And um, what does that mean? Can we sit down and talk? Sit down. Mm. Anita has told me a lot of negative things about you two. Especially you, Kosi. But I'll go straight to the point. Anita is a very, very wicked human being. We know that already. And come see, he's a very nice guy. Anita does not deserve him one bit. All she cares about is his money. She sees him as an ATM machine to bring out money. So Kosi, please, help him. Be with him. Uh, what do you mean? Aside Anita, you are the next woman he values and cares about. Yes. So I see that you are the only one that can save him. I, I, I don't understand. Why me? Why does it have to be me? Aren't you equally a beautiful woman <laughs> who a man can value? Why don't you be with him? <laughs> you think I've not tried? I have, yes. But the innocent guy does not care about anybody apart from Anita. But with you, I see you can save him. So please, save him. Save, save Kamsi. On the floor, all of you! So, so Priscilla, you I call my best friend have the gods to betray me, right? Oh, shut up your mouth! Jesus. You're such a wicked soul. I always knew you'd been jealous of me all this time. No, you're a two-sided person. Jesus, Jesus. And as for you, Cossy, say your last prayer now. What's going on? Are you shocked? James? What are you doing here? Oh, I asked him to come. I was the one that paid him to offload the gun. Anita, you're very wicked. But I never knew you could go this extent. Baby, it's not what you think. I was trying to fight for my love. Anita, how could you be so ruthless? So ruthless? Do not call me names. You're the cause of all this. How could you prefer helping people over your fiancé? Yes, I know I maltreated Kosi and Ibube, but that doesn't justify any of your actions. I even apologized to you, but you snubbed me. I was upset. Upset? How? Was that why you couldn't call me or check up on me when I left? Oh. Now I know my existence never really mattered to you. A matter of fact, it did. I loved you so much. I could literally lay down my life for you. You know what? I was missing you. I wanted to come and talk things over to see if I could just, you know, make amends because your friend Priscilla said that you were at the shop. Only for me to come and overhear your wicked plot and conversation. Anita, how could you? How could you be so... After all I did for you, I was ready to do anything for you. Give you the luxury life you wanted. Give you everything. And all you could do was to cheat on me with a low life. You never even cared about me. Oh, I see. You only like me because of my money, right? Yes. That actually explains the reason why you wouldn't let me help anybody. You just want me to bring and be spending only on you. Come on. Anita. How, how on earth was I going to find out if, if not for this amazing lady here, Priscilla? I least expected this from you. Like I 
can see why no man has ever loved you. Shh! You have no moral justification to judge me. You don't deserve a man like Kamsi. If I can't have him, I'd rather Kosi have him. Because she's a hard working lady. Not like you. Materialistic gold. And how dare you! <laughs> how dare you! <laughs> you guys are here. Nice. Yes, the culprit is here. I'm, so, I'm sorry. Outside. I'm baby. coming now. Hey, yes. baby, no, please do not let him take me yes, away, please. Yes. You yes. are being bad for you. Kosi, what's going on here? What's with the bags? Huh? I thought I told you I got you guys. Anita is gone. She's definitely in the police custody and she's not coming back. You're safe, right? Sir, thank you. Thank you so much for everything, but I'm sorry. We, we can't continue to stay here anymore. We've caused you so much trouble. My sister and I will just go to the village and... I love you, Kosi. I've loved you for a long time. Beyond the charity and trying to be sure you guys are good and all, I realize that, I, that I'm drawn to you. But you see, I'm a one-woman kind of guy and I wasn't going to cheat on my girlfriend. But today, Fate played out. And it's obvious to me that that's not the kind of woman that I want to spend the rest of my life with. Definitely not the kind of woman that I want to raise my kids with. You see, Kosi, everything about you is beautiful. Honestly, I really wish that you're gonna stay here with me forever. I literally wish that you'd be the woman Who's gonna be the mother of my kids? I've always loved you too. From the moment you looked into my eyes in the hospital and assured me that my sister would live again, I've been drawn to you like I've never been with anyone my entire life. You're so kind. Your heart is big. You're generous, not just to us, but to everybody around you. Who wouldn't love a man like you? Not only did you stand by me in the hospital, you also went as far as clearing our hospital bills. Only God knows that we didn't have anyone to help us. I must have been hard on to met you. You saved us. You saved my sister. You saved us again today in the house of your crazy girlfriend. She was going to kill us. Until you came right on time as you always do. But I'm afraid I, I, I don't want the world to think that you and I had something going on that led to you breaking up with your woman. Kosi, listen to me. Anita is a thing of the past. And I assure you, she's not going to hurt you. She's definitely going to be charged for illegal possession of weapons and attempted murder. You are safe. But it's fine. I'm, I'm not going to push. I'll allow you to take your time. Process everything I've told you. Go through it. We see. I wish, and I still say it again, 
I wish that you guys are gonna be here with me. Cozy, stay with me, please. In the meantime, please, I beg you.